Now let's continue working on this fantastic topic, logarithms, and let's combine these into one single logarithm. And before we, we start combining the logs, we can just raise the exponents. So 2 log z can be rewritten as log z squared minus log x to the power of half, so I'm raising the exponent here as well, minus log y cubed. Okay, so before I go on, I'm just going to make one small change to this. x to the half, I'm just going to make it the square root of x. And here we still have log y cubed. Now, we're subtracting logs so we can divide the contents. So we get log z squared over root x minus log y cubed. Great, so now again we're dividing logs, or sorry, we're subtracting logs, so we're going to divide the contents once again. And in this case, what I can do is just multiply by the reciprocal of 1 over 3. And by reciprocal, I just mean that y cubed over 1 will become y, sorry, 1 over y cubed. So these are perfectly equivalent. Hopefully that makes sense to everyone. And now I can just rewrite everything as log z squared over root x times y cubed. And let's just draw a dividing line here. 